Welcome to Mathematics with Ams, Grade 9 lesson on Ratio. Please give me a huge like and subscribe. A ratio is a way of comparing two or more quantities of the same kind. It is written in the form A with a colon and then a B. And we say A is to B. A and B are called the quantities of the ratio. For, look at the example. 3 is to 1. So 3 blue blocks is to 1 yellow. Meaning that for every 1 yellow block, there's 3 blue. Or for every 3 blue, there's 1 yellow. Take note, ratios have no units. The order in which we express the ratio is important because you can't just switch three and one. Example, if there are two boys and three girls in a group, then the ratio of boys to girls is two is to three. And the ratio of girls to boys is three is to two. So it all depends which one do you name first. Ratios are always expressed in the simplest form. Don't forget, for example, 62 is always is the same as 3 is to 1. So ratios must always be simplified. So a ratio of two quantities can be expressed also as a fraction. Right, so also don't forget that a ratio is a fraction. Now a ratio can be expressed as a percentage. Example, express the ratio 4 is to 5 as a percentage. Now remember, a ratio is also a fraction, so 4 is to 5 is the same as 4 fifths, and if you multiply that by 20 over 20, which is basically times 1, so it doesn't change 4 fifths, then you, you multiply the numerators, which gives you 80, multiply the denominator, gives you 100, and we all know that 80 out of 100 is 80%. Express ratio with quantities given in different units. So what ratio is 125 milliliter of milk to 1 liter of milk? So it's different uh, units, so we need to convert. Right, so we need to convert, so you need to convert uh, rather milliliters, so you divide to liters, so you divide it by a thousand. So 125 by 1,000 gives you 1 eighth. So therefore, the ratio is 1 is to 8. Let's do some calculations with ratios. Example 1. Divide 300 apples amongst A, B, and C in the ratio 1 is to 5 is to 9. So the first step is, is to add 1 and 5 and 9, and it gives you 15. So the first one will be 1 out of 15, the second one will be 5 out of 15, and the third one will be 9 out of 15. And each one must be multiplied by 300. So therefore the first one is 20, second one is 100, and the third one is 180. Example number two, increase 28 kilogram in the ratio 13 is to 7. So if you increase, place what you want on top of the line, biggest number on top because we want to increase. If you want to decrease, we put the smallest number on top. So 13 over 7 times the 28 gives you 52. If you decrease, then it must be two thirds times the 45 minutes, which gives you 30. Let's look at a few examples. Simplify the ratio 55 is to 121. So 55 is to 121, write as a fraction, and then what you can do is, you can divide both the 55 and the 121 by 11 to give you 5 over 11. This is one of many ways to simplify the ratio. Number two, Express 50 rand is to 500 rand as a percentage. So 50 rand is to 500 rand. If you simplify, it's the same as 1 is to 10, which is 1 over 10 times 10 over 10 to give you 10 over 100. So therefore, 10%. The third one, divide 1,200 rand between partners Jimmy and Tabang 
according to the ratio 65 is to 35 percent so 65 percent is to 35 is same as 65 is to 35 remember you must lose the units simplify and you get 13 is to 7 we can of course divide by 5 then 13 plus 7 gives you 20 so the first one for uh, the first for Jimmy will be 13 after 20 times 1200 gives you 780 rand and then of course the bank 7 out of 20 times 1200 gives you 420 rand you can always double check your answer by adding the two values and you should get the original 1200 D number 4 decrease 60 minutes in the ratio 2 is to 3 if you want to decrease remember the smaller number on top so it's 2 thirds times 60 therefore 40 I hope you have enjoyed this lesson with uh, Mathematics with M's on ratio. Please don't forget to give me a huge like and to subscribe.